Okay guys, so just in this quick video, I want to show you guys is this hacking website that it teaches you hacking or ethical hacking for absolutely for free, which I mean, I'm pretty sure everyone loves free stuff, don't we? Right? So this website is called hackthissite.org and it teaches you basically, it's not like CTF puzzles, it is basically like real life hacking and real life examples. And what it allows you is to basically either develop your skills or check your skills, right? So maybe you're lacking on something maybe website exploitation so you can do this maybe you're lacking on basically reading through the source code so there's many many possibilities that basically if you want to polish up your skills and you want to learn hacking for free what you can do is come to this website register set a good password and you're good to go right so once you this requires you to sign up because if you don't sign up it, it won't basically allow you to do these challenges right it only asks for your email i think password and login that's it right so there's like it doesn't require you to know deposit some crypto or something it's free right so uh, these are challenges now i recommend if basically going through them challenges um it's really up to you what you do so there's basic realistic and then stuff um, i actually went through a couple i've done about eight basic and three realistic i'm going to show you one cool level that i found and i just want to show you basically how this website looks like so we have for example get informed which is i recommend checking this section because it is very 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 good and very important you can get some free information about hacking and obviously the best way to learn hacking is to actually do hacking and um, get involved so you can uh, donate for i've not donated myself but i'll probably donate in the future you can communicate through the forums discord it's really up to you if you want to do that um that's just information regarding the website and there's partners here and to be honest there's just some blogs basically some articles and stuff um so what I can recommend, as I said, is going through this, um, getting, no, sorry, it's getting formed. So if you're interested, go through useful stuff. It shows you, not only it doesn't show you tools, it shows you some actual um, information. Also, if you're interested, what you can do is if you go at the bottom or press Ctrl F, press, press Ctrl F, and you type in Jack, it's going to give you a website. And this website is pretty good because it answers some question, how to become a hacker. Um, obviously it's not going to say you do this do this do this because this isn't, it never works like that no one will tell you that because it's not that's not how easy it is hacking is difficult so you need to have you need to be basically um you need to be patient with hacking right that's the main point i can give you i'm already sort of making a video how to how to learn hacking quicker from my personal experience but that'll take me some time because i need to make some material and stuff so stay tuned maybe next week or something like that um, anyways, coming back to the website, what I'm going to show you is one cool level. I actually have sort of enjoyed that very level because I was... Um, I'm going to also show you. So, if you go back up to the website and we go through the levels... Come on. No, I'm just taking this time for some reason. My computer isn't really cooperating with me recently. So, if you go to realistic... If you go through the source code, you're going to find a website. And up the PHP delete the source code and as you can see it is a login page so remember just like i said a couple of videos back do not ever try to brute force that should be your last resort of your options you should always try to sort of bypass the login page or start to maybe burp suite try try to do something apart from brute forcing because first of all by doing this you polish up your skills even more and by doing brute forcing you don't really learn anything what you could do is run brute forcing right like as a as a in the background and you could try and exploit yourself right that obviously is a much much better way so what we're going to do is obviously now the first thing that came to my mind when i was then okay i don't have a login page right i tried admin admin it didn't work i've tried some other credentials it didn't work okay but this is a login page right login pages have connections to databases well okay let's try sql injection right so i just put some first first payload i could find let me just copy something first payload i could find and that's just submit query and if you as you can see, you have already done this, which means I have completed this level. That's true, I have completed this level. But that was a very, very easy level. So this is teaches you, that's why, that's why I like this website. Because it teaches you, allows you to sort of think for yourself and allows you to try different stuff. CTFs are like this as well, but sometimes people do like... CTFs are... They, they want you to do a CTF a certain way, which I don't really like that because I like to try different stuff out. I like to... Maybe this works, maybe this works. Right? So that's why I really, really like this website. And I do recommend checking this website because first of all, it's free. 
it's not some scam and it is a very very good website so make sure that you check this website it's absolutely free use a virtual machine i do recommend highly using kali linux for this because it'll make your life easier it allows you to use some allows you to use basically tools within the system right so you don't have to install anything on your host system you can just use the virtual machine and go ahead and do ctfs now please a very very important um disclaimer please don't run if you're running any like for example if you want to run a directory bust please limit the requests to so you don't ddos the website right because i don't know how strong this website is but please try and limit the requests so you don't break the website immediately right or just ddos it just please so you don't also you don't disrupt others so just please limit your requests to couple requests a second 5 10 it should be enough right if you enjoyed leave a like subscribe comment and check my other video which should be right somewhere on the screen it's a full hacking course for free also for free you don't have to pay anything so check my hacking course absolutely for free thank you for watching guys